are going to beach church this morning. Never ever before have we gone to church barefoot and taken the dog with us, but this morning we're doing both of those. It's actually something that Emily and I have been really looking forward to uh, as we have prepared for this cruising lifestyle. We've seen other people on Instagram <laughs> Dixie's little doggy talking friend about is it. here and going to church also. <laughs> And uh, yeah, sorry, I'm a little bit out of breath. Just got done pulling the dinghy up on the beach there. So. <laughs> <laughs> he just lifted his leg and peed on the side of our dinghy. That's yeah, okay. That's right. <laughs> you gotta go and you gotta go, buddy. <laughs> Well, we just finished church and what an awesome time this is like bringing all these people together there was probably i don't know 60 people yeah, today it was, it like was full. it was full, full. House. we were having to look for more benches um really really cool and non-denominational church there's no memberships they don't pass around a basket if you want to help it's you know how to help everyone's like, volunteers yeah georgetown is known as the velcro harbor and we're starting to learn why really fast just in the few days that we've been here but one of those reasons and the main reason i guess is just to the community here when you have 350 plus boats in the harbor here and you have the morning cruisers net and you have a spectra water maker dealer on his cruising boat and you have a guy that's per, you know knows how to fix engines you have a guy that's an electrician you have a jack of all trades all around you and easy access to parts and good food as well as well let me show you paradise behind you it makes it really really easy to just come and stay and hold on to that velcro patch because well what more can you ask for Let me just tell you, this community is so cool. Look at these guys behind us. That is the Neo 43, and that's Bobby from Sailing Doodles. I like your boat. There you go. Hey, 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 Steph. Hey, what's up? How are you guys? Good to see you. Good to see Look you. at the toys on the back of it and everything. Hi, Bobby. How's it been? Good, how are you guys doing? Good. doesn't matter what time of day it is. If there is a bug around, specifically specifically a mosquito or a sand gnat, it will bite Emily. And she's on me all the time about sunscreen, as I've mentioned to you guys before. But she forgets to put insect repellent on, and then she gets these horrible, horrible allergic reactions when she gets bit. So. I think it's time I pull a trick out of her playbook and tape the insect repellent to her sunscreen. She'll remember then. I got you. Mosquitoes all over your arm. Aww. Ooh, I know I can feel them biting me. We're on our way to Monument Hill and it's like a little jungle walking through here. This is so cool. This little narrow path with trees and limbs over the top of you and all around you. Really oh, no, neat. Two more. Oh. Jeez, you were just I need to like eaten up by I need to elbow. run. Hey, on your elbow. On your elbow. Yep. Nope. Uh, higher. Smack it. I... Smack it. <laughs> ah! Something on my back of my arm. I think that's the one that's already bit me. One day you're gonna put insect propellant on. It's the like middle of put, the day! Just like you put uh sunscreen on. Three. <laughs> Oh, this is pretty steep. Yeah. Whoa. 
<laughs> there's, that's why there's a rope. Trying to hold the camera for you guys. Climb up this without falling down. We've got all the tools. <laughs> of the trade. Vloggers be like. <laughs> You're doing great, babe. I love the feeling that you're giving me for me. I just want to live, live through. I know the pain, I know the pain. Oh, Steep climb. I'll bet the view's worth it, though. Totally worth it. We're almost there. We can see the monument. Oh! So you get up to Monument Hill here and one of the interesting facts about this island is there's no more rocks to be found. In fact, we haven't seen any rocks that you could actually pick up this entire trip. Well, that was until we got up here. And then we found all the rocks. I don't know if you guys can see with this lens on, but below us here on the beach are thousands upon thousands of rocks spelling out names, boat names, peace signs, uh, Christian fish, heart, all kinds of things just scattered across this uh, beach or sand, I guess, uh, sandbar here. And so all of the rocks are now there. In fact, I don't know if we're gonna be able to find enough rocks to put our name out there. Adventure Cruise is long. Adventure Cruise <laughs> is a very long name when you're trying to spell it in rocks. about the Monument Hill area is at the top you can look down and see all the anchorages in Elizabeth Harbor and then on the other side you just look to the other side and you can see the Exuma Sound better known as the Atlantic Ocean and there's a trail that walks down to the Atlantic side so that's where we are now and just the views all around are seriously so beautiful I want to say it's the be most beautiful water and views we've seen I feel like we say this every time but that's part of what makes this area cruiser's paradise. The Exumas being as beautiful as they are, as cruiser friendly, all the anchorages. It's just truly incredible. So I'm gonna say it again. This is the most beautiful view we've seen so far. I've ever said before because it wasn't true. This is the most beautiful beach we've ever seen. I mean, just look at it. Just look at it. Would you just look at it? Guys, while well, we could stay here all day and enjoy this beach, we've got a special surprise for you today. We haven't been there ourselves, but we've heard amazing things and we're excited to share it with you. So let's get going. Hey guys, hope you're enjoying the video and I'm super excited to be introducing you our exclusive sponsor for the remainder of this series. This is Waves RX and they make a whole array of boat products including cleaners, boat lines, fenders, personal watercraft uh, anchors and I am just super happy to have them on board with us at the Adventure Cruise because this product is actually one that I bought uh, months ago. We bought the we bought their lines before our Hurricane Ian series. If you watch those, you'll know that we had 19 lines on our boat when we walked away from it before the hurricane. Just couldn't have enough lines. And after the hurricane went through, I realized how great these lines were. And I actually reordered another two times after that. And I recently reached out to them and found out they're actually a Sarasota-based company, which was super exciting to me because that's obviously our home ports. But I reached out to them because these lines are the best lines I could find on the internet at the best cost. 
So I'm excited to have them on board and please go check out their website. You can find them at wavesrx.com or you can find them on Amazon. And the best thing about it is they're giving all of our viewers a 20% discount. You can use that code on Amazon or on their website, which is also really, really cool. Thank you guys so much and back to the video. Go ahead. Back up, back up. Let's just tie the front. Good. Go ahead. I think it's okay to let the motor Here down. Go. Watch out, Dixie. Yep. Are you on it? Yeah, I'll drive. Okay, go ahead. Watch out, Dixie. Dixie, move. Dixie. Over here, up, here. up front, up front. Oh. There you go. Right, stay. Go stay. Good? I think we're just barely scraping All the right, bottom. Alright, I'll push it off. Go ahead and get started. It's fine. Right. Welcome to Dust. Sandbar, that's duh, not the. We came here yesterday, we didn't really do any filming because we've had just a long couple of days in the school of hard knocks, but we're back today for a musical experience. We're gonna share with you guys the steel drums. Sounds like they've taken a break now, but you can see tons of cruisers here. Again, why this is cruiser's paradise. Look, everybody's here. Even some familiar faces. Even some familiar faces. Ken, if you've uh, seen any of our series from the Berry Island, you'll remember Ken and Nancy. They're here. We know a couple of our other friends are here. We'll introduce you to them. It's going to be fun. Let's go check it out. That's you right. Two are. Hey, where are those guys? here to play beach Jenga, but we did bring you here for the musical experience that Emily was talking about earlier, yep. which is back started. So we're gonna kind of just show you guys what we're talking about. So as we've been talking all day about this community, it's only fitting that we have friends on board for a dinner. And as I just showed with you guys, shared with you guys, we are cranking up the smoker for the first time. We've got Sailing Kismet here, and they came over from Long Island yesterday. Uh, we actually had sushi with them last night, which was amazing. But we're gonna take this tuna and do something we've never, e either of us have ever done before, and that's actually smoke the tuna. So this is Paula, and this is Aaron, and they brought their buddy boat friends with us. Remind me one more. Josh. Josh, and your wife Ashley. is Ashley. 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 Ashley, as they call her. So I, we're gonna have to hear about the stories of how that name came about. I have a feeling they're uh, gonna be fun stories, but. But one thing we haven't told you yet, so we actually met Paula and Aaron when we were in Annapolis in October. So that was really cool because we were all up in the States in October, and now everyone is dispersed throughout the Bahamas and Caribbean and beyond. So. Just really cool to be able to reunite in a beautiful place. It's the cool community. The cool community. If you guys aren't thinking about joining it or aren't haven't joined it, you're missing out. All the cool kids are doing it. <laughs> <laughs> talking about this entire day this community is amazing and we totally understand how Georgetown can be the Velcro Harbor because you're surrounded by so many awesome people but with that it is dinner time and we are going to say good night and see you guys tomorrow